The Vice President of the Wabeg District Women SME Association, Joanne, says the association is not affiliated with any particular grouping but belongs to all the women in the ward councils within Wabeg District interested in participating in SME programs. So this is the association now. Everybody group your words. So Mary, you start the one one words, meet up in this, the Suruti, Godan, Hakon, Loyal Valley, Kono, Maramuni. You can organize the word play you plan. The Wabak District Development Authority is empowering women folks in the district to participate in SME programs. The Minister for Fisheries and Member for Wabag, Honorable Dr. Lino Tom, says mothers are the pillar and better managers in a family, and the Wabag District Development Authority is adamant in providing opportunities for the women folks to participate in the SME sector. Dr. Lino Tom says because of the women's pivotal role in the family, the Wabag District Development Authority has agreed to hand over the management of the new Wabag main market to the Wabag District Women SME Group. The member for Wabag further committed 1 million kina to the Women SME Program, of which 500,000 kina will be allocated before the 2022 national election and the other half after the election. The NA Governor, Chief Sepita Ipetas, when officially launching the Wabag District Women's SME Program, also committed 500,000 kina to the program. Meanwhile, the UN Women Country Representative in Papua New Guinea, Caroline Nyamayamombi, says the UN Women is delighted to partner Wabag Women SME Association to help empower them. And uh, we have uh, been so humbled to know that the women are going to be managing this market. happening in PNG. And again, women, we are ready to support the women to do it well. So that other provinces can be inspired from what is happening here in Wada. So thank you very much and congratulations. Leslie Kelly, NBC National News, Wabag.